You know that I'ma keep it cool With you I feel like breaking rules On the edge looking out with no parachute You know I'm dreaming about us who Playing around without a clue On the edge cleaning out With us it's all or nothing Oh, but guess I need more of you Are you ready to work out? No, I am not Good morning Welcome to this summer day in the life in the David Collins shop house. I'm starting off the day waking up at 6 a.m. after sleeping five hours. Oh my word. Honestly, there was quite a lot more people than I expected to. Two to three times more people than I thought. In around one hour, my brother is gonna arrive with Brownie, my brother's dog, and her puppies, which includes my future dog. And so I'm very, very happy about that. So let's hop in the shower, start working, and then in one hour, babysit those little puppies. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Let's go. I just finished taking a shower for my workout. In 20 minutes, my brother is gonna arrive with the little puppies. Today is gonna be a typical summer day in my life as a college dropout. I'm gonna be waking up early in the morning and do something productive, aka working out today. I'm gonna be working the entire day and at around 12, I'm gonna be hanging out with my friends because it's summer right now and most of my friends aren't really working aside from myself. And so, let's get it working. Usually during my days, since I'm living in a big family, there's always distractions and unexpected events happening. And so today was one of those days. Oh, he just arrived. He just arrived. My brother just arrived. There we go. At this point, I completely forgot about work. I was so happy seeing these babies and I spent the next 25 minutes with them. I even cleaned my first ever dog pee, which I was pretty proud of. I've never really been a big dog person before. But the moment my brother got his a year ago, I really, really started to love them. And so the moment my brother asked me if I wanted one of his puppies, I was super, super excited about it. And then I remembered that I had to work, so I brought all the puppies inside my room to keep an eye on them while working. If this isn't life, I don't know what is. So right now is the right time to work because every puppy is sleeping. And so let's get going and let's start the paper session. By this point, I was doing super focused work for the next 30 minutes because they were all asleep. But then my body started demanding something. And you know what that means? It means eating time, baby. Cooking this ramen was super easy. But as I head back to my room, I had just found the eighth one of the world. Now look at what I am seeing right now. Oh my word. And then I had another surprise coming in. I barely worked today. I worked like two hours so far. My brother's dog started peeing and pooping here. And it was a pretty big one. So reality is I cleaned it up. I put it in the toilet. I don't want to put that like in a trash can like this. Now the toilet is full and I have to do this little thing. This is the reality of a day in my life. So as I tried to unclog this toilet, I also had to take care of the little puppies and make sure they're all okay because my brother gave me the responsibility of them. And in 30 minutes, I'll be meeting my friends at an amusement park to spend the rest of the day. And on the way there, I also helped my mom deliver some food for her food business. So for the rest of the day, we did what typical college students do during summer. So we just hung out. Ninja. 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 After going to the amusement park, we went out and tried a restaurant we haven't been to before. Their dumplings were pretty amazing, by the way. And then after that, we went to Boba to end the day right. And this was a typical day in my life as a college dropout during summer. See you next time.